will show you how you can download and install data loader for Mac. First, you can go to uh, Google and type data loader for Mac. So you will um, get search results. Click on the first result where you will see this page developer.salesforce.com where it has um, uh, there are so many information given step by step information step by step uh, procedure of how to install. So on which you can click on this one uh, for Mac OS. So yeah, it, it is uh, showing error now. Um, so when you click on that link it will be uh, taking you to this um, azul.com website where you should be downloading this latest version you can download any version but uh, you can download this latest version dmg dot dmg uh, file so it is getting downloaded and um, it's completed now i will open this when i open this i can see um, double click to install a Zulu dot pkg. So I'm just down, uh, double clicking it. So it's showing me some warning, just clicking on OK. So this is the installation page. So just click on continue install. So it's asking me password. I'm giving the password. So installing. So it is got installed. So once installed, it will be moved to bin. And uh, once installing uh, this Azul Zulu, uh, we will have to install the data loader. So uh, for installing data loader, you can go to uh, login on to uh, login into the Salesforce um, page org, um, search for data loader in the quick find where you will be getting this page. And here in the downloads, you can click on the downloads and confirm uh, so the uh, since i'm using mac um, only mac is enabled so uh, click on download release so i've got it now i'm opening the file uh, when you open the file you would see install dot command in uh, click on this install dot command when you double click on it it will show you this error message so you will be clicking on ok just click on control and then click on uh, open okay when you click on control it's like right um, right click so click on control and click open choose open and uh, though the developer is not verified this time it will be um, getting installed so we are getting we are uh, taken to the uh, data loader installation command uh, prompt uh, window where provide the installation directory i'm just uh, um, clicking on the return i mean entering uh, clicking uh, i mean i'm just entering clicking on enter button uh, so if so uh, I'm, it is just asking me if not installation will quit so do you want to override the previously installed versions of uh, data loader so since i have the previous version it is asking me whether to override i'm just giving yes so, so do you want to create an icon to launch? So, yes, I want an icon. So I'm just giving, I'm typing yes here. And do you want uh, to create a link? So I don't want link. Uh, so I, I'm just giving no. Process is completed. So installation, since the installation process completed, I'm closing the window. And I'm going to check this, uh, check whether I have created this, um, yeah. Now you could see the data loader um, icon in the desktop, double click on it. And when you double click, you can see the data loader is getting opened here. Um, here you can, uh, you, you, from this step, you know, right? Uh, how to insert all the actions, you know. So that's all about how to install data loader um, in Mac. That's all, thank you. So hope you got to know how to install data loader for Mac and also how to insert a record to Salesforce using data loader in Mac. Uh, please let me know in the comments if it is working fine for you. 
and if you find any difficulties please uh, give comments and mention the difficulties that you are facing in the comments so that i'll be able to resolve it also while working uh, with in mac uh, while working with salesforce in mac if you find any uh, trouble or any issue or difficulty while working with any concepts in mac you can just let me know so that i'll be able to resolve those issues in my next video and uh, subscribe to our channel to keep yourself uh, updated in salesforce thank you